Hi everyone, this is Pamela and today I just would like to talk about this case of Angie Diaz that it was really horrible and I won't be just talking about what happened to her because the one who are aware of the situation know how horribly she died but the lesson from this that we have to learn is that you need to take your time to meet somebody and for what I heard, because I just watched many videos in regard to this news, is that she met this guy and 10 days later she got married. And you know, that was a huge red flag. None of her friends were there. And you know, that's just telling you that that was very dangerous because they just jumped into something very serious really fast and she didn't have the time to even know who he was. And even their friends, they claim, and you know, in their interviews, they were saying things like, we didn't, we didn't know anything about him. We didn't know, you know, where he come from and stuff like that. But the thing about this is that I know it can be really tempting, especially when you see a guy that is very handsome like he is, because you can tell that physically he can be very attractive for any girl. And I understand that she was 21 and she wasn't mature enough to realize that what she was facing was something that, that it was very dangerous. I know it happened. There are situations, there are people that are married for 20 years and then after that, they, the husband kill the wife or the other way around. You never know somebody, you know, completely. But at least, you know, try to avoid to be in a situation where you jumped into something very serious like living with somebody else or you know getting married really fast because you know it's better for you to take your time and see the patterns it's not the action per se but the patterns because somebody can be perfect for three months but showing the patterns is going to tell you a little bit of the character of somebody and for them to not be able to keep up with the promise of something they are giving you in the first month it's when you're going to see whether or not they were lying you know and Yes, always taking your time because that will allow you to stay or be in an abusive relationship. What I also uh, heard is that uh, the last time they, they saw her, they went to this Christmas party and from their job and then he left the party really angry because he was jealous. And his parents were also claiming that they always were like uh, fighting, having this uh, argument. So, after she just started, uh, you know, she got married with him, she changed a little bit. You can tell from her videos that she was a really happy person, then she started changing. So basically, she was already in an abusive relationship with this guy, but this ended up really tragic tragically. So, you know, the lesson from this is just take your time, never jump to, into a relationship really fast, especially for the benefits that these relationships seem to bring you because you can tell she didn't have documents and getting married with him representing something was representing something really big for her but maybe at the end of the day he was always having uh, those bad intentions with her you never know so it's more for you to think about that uh, never get desperate about it because sometimes uh, loneliness can seem to be something sad but I guess it's worse just to be in with the wrong person because that will just drain you a lot so i hope you can subscribe to my channel see you the next time and i would like you just to give me some comments what are your opinions about this case